I'm home, and believe it or not, I'm actually cold. It's sunny, it's warm out there, but my body temperature just feels cold, and I think it's just everything that's happening. Uh, I think my body's just worn down right now. It's It's been a lot, a lot's going on, and it's taken an emotional toll on me, that's for sure. I made a coffee. I've got this much left. It's, it's pretty good, as you can tell. I just was like, I need a coffee. I'm back home and done and everything's over with. Uh, I was in the dealership for 25 minutes and signed three papers, turned over my keys, they took a picture of the odometer. They looked at the car, my salesman and another woman. And um, I got my license plate and I told them to just keep the um, phone holder. They could take it off and just get rid of it. That's real sticky underneath. And, you know, he said they have a cleaner. They'll just wipe that off. So the car is gone. I'm carless now. I cried. I did. Um, I'm just thinking of the places that I would normally go and how I'm going to get there. So I'm checking the boxes off. All of my doctor and therapy stuff will be telehealth, uh, except for the one I have that in a week and a half where I see my doctor for the last time before he retires. I want to see him in person. I want to be able to give him a hug. I want to thank him for being my doctor for 27 years. But the rest of them then will all be telephone or telehealth. My psychiatrist, my therapist, my PCP, because I'll be moved over to Sky's, who was Sky's PCP, um, is what I'm being told. And, uh, my prescriptions, my old friend said he could pick them up or he could get me and take me down to CVS and get them. One of them is a three month. So that's just every 90 days. The other one is once a month and I could have them mail it through the postal service. Um, if they do that, it'll take an extra three days for me to get it. So I'll just have to make a decision on that. But they did say that anybody could come in and pick it up for me as long as they have my date of birth and my name. So that's pretty easy. And groceries will be delivered by Walmart. And my son has DoorDash and the little store at the corner. They use DoorDash also. And my son can add me for free. So that's that. Um... And other than getting spring water, which again, my friend said, let me know when you need spring water, when you have like five empty gallons, I'll take you down and you can get your spring water. So that's it. If I take a walk, I can walk down to the lake. I can walk up to the corner store. If I want to just take a walk or go and pick up, you know, one or two bags full of things. If I decide I want to do that, I can do that. It's literally a half a block. Um, so I came home, I called the car insurance, I canceled that. They said they'll send a refund check in seven to 10 days, uh, prorating approximately three months. So that's that. The gap insurance that I have through Toyota Financial, my salesman said that'll take a little bit longer. That'll be a couple of months before I get that check. That, he said that will be $300 for sure. Um, yeah. So, uh, yes, we start another new chapter. I lose my partner. I lose my car. I hope that's it for right now. Like, I don't want to lose my mind. And uh, I'm trying to make the best decisions for me 
being just me. You know, and this is hard. Like without having someone here next to you when you're used to, you know, turning to your your person and saying, what do you think? What, what should we do with this? And then you're on your own and you go, okay, got to get this figured out. What makes the most sense? So that's um, that's done now. And I have two less keys in my pocketbook. I had a car key and Sky had a car key. And uh, so that's that. June 28th. Four months and one day after Sky passed away, uh, my car went. So, um, my son's surgery is Tuesday. They scheduled him for Tuesday, and they told him he'll be in 24 to 72 hours post-op, depending on how he does. The doctor said in most cases it's closer to the 72 hours than it is for the 24 hours. And I still have not looked up the name of the little um, implant they're going to put in his chest to get more oxygen to his heart. The surgery is two and a half to three and a half hours, barring any complications. Uh, we're going to do a FaceTime later. Right now he's with... Um, a doctor and I'm just so worn out you guys I'm just so worn out so I'm going to just lay here I've been up since 2 o'clock 212 I got a messenger ding through at 212 and that woke me and um So I've been awake since then, so I'm, I'm feeling it. Just along with the emotional stuff, you know. But I'll be okay. I'll be okay. I'll get used to it. And Uber and Lyft will become my new best friends. And, uh... Uh, yeah. I, uh... I'll be okay. So I'm going to go. We'll make this real brief. I'm just, I'm exhausted. And uh, my salesman said, Poet, when you're ready to get another car, or if you see, if we send you, you know, a notice about a car and you're interested, let me know. You have my private cell phone number. And I do. He's such a sweet man. He's like, He's probably 30, maybe he's 30, 28, 29, 30. Young guy, but so nice, so caring. Um, they'll turn around and sell that car for a nice, a nice penny, you know. But um, he said once the election year passes, then things will change up because every time there's an election year, there's a change like one way or the other, you know. So there'll be a change as far as interest rates and things like that. Um, so I'm hoping to have a car by the time I have to find my next home. So I know by the end of April, I will be giving notice here that I'm leaving. Again, barring anything big happening in my life, you know, me meeting someone and they want to live here and you know that all works out which I don't see happening at all uh I don't talk to anyone here and uh I'm not on any dating sites I'm not you know it's just me myself and Zen Rain speaking of Zen Rain I changed her into another outfit this morning here she is with her little sidekick. Come here, Venus. There's Venus. Gotta admit, she's kind of sweet. So, 
Thank you for choosing me. You guys are amazing. Can you imagine what it would be like for me if I didn't have my family that's on here? You guys, what this would feel like for me? If I didn't have people reaching out through Messenger here and there. I got that. I got my lavender oil. I got my little girl. And Sweet Mary sent me an Amazon gift card so I could pick something for my birthday. That wasn't expected. None of that was expected. None of it. God led is what I keep hearing. God led. I'm kind of hoping God leads me to someone to love me. I'm, I'm kind of ready to move forward. I'm ready. This is not my um, ideal, this kind of life. Not my ideal, no. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna maybe take a nap. Again, what am I hearing? Oh, the ice cream man, ice cream truck. You probably can't hear it. Now maybe you can. Somebody getting ice cream? I gotta look, because the, the music stopped. Music usually only stops when somebody's getting ice cream. I think somebody is getting ice cream. Oh, how cool. He is right out there. I don't know if you can see the truck through the trees. Yeah, he's getting ice cream. The truck right there. I have ice cream up in the freezer that I bought for Kenny. He's got, he's on a diet overhaul with his heart as weak as it is. He uh, isn't going to be eating much ice cream. So I think the ice cream will end up going in the sink and it'll melt. It's a uh, chocolate, it's a uh, vanilla chip, which is not, you know, I don't want it. It's not my thing. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Thank you for being here. Thank you for choosing me. And I choose you. So it's a win-win, right? I'll talk to you guys soon.